Welcome to ProTech's on-demand training modules. In this module, we will be discussing the deployment of a system using a Shure MXA910 array microphone and the ANTI USB matrix. To get started, launch Shure Designer software. With my project selected in the left-hand side, click New and select Project. Give it a name and description and click Create. A location must be added to the project. With the Location tab highlighted across the top, click New, select Location, and give it a name. Navigate to the Devices Online notification in the bottom left of the window. Devices that are in need of initialization are presented with a new icon next to their device name. Select Initialize the Devices from the warning prompt. Initializing a device allows you to add it to the location and set a password. Close the Online Devices window. Select Live Mode and your newly initialized devices will appear in the Online Devices section. Click and drag your devices into the workspace. Navigate to the Signal Flow tab across the top and your online devices will appear in the Signal Flow schematic. Place your devices where you see fit. The Annie USB matrix allows for four Dante input channels, so we'll utilize the mix output channel on the MXA910. This will allow us to use the maximum number of eight lobes on the MXA910, as well as the 910's onboard Intellimix digital signal processing. Simply click and drag the last output channel on the MXA910 to the first input channel on the Annie USB matrix. The Annie USB matrix does not have built-in acoustic echo cancellation, so we will use the AEC found on the MXA910. To do this, the far end conferencing audio must be routed to the AEC reference input on the MXA910. Click and drag one of the Dante output channels on the Annie USB matrix to the AEC reference input channel on the MXA910. We will use output one on the Annie USB matrix. Next, select the Anti USB matrix and click Configure. Double click the matrix mixer block and click the checkbox found at the intersection of Dante Output 1 and USB Input. Close the Anti USB matrix configuration window. Select the MXA910 and click Configure. Navigate to the Intellimix tab across the top and select AEC found in the Automix Output section. Confirm that the acoustic echo canceller is turned on. Launch your desired conferencing application and select the Sure Any USB Matrix as your microphone and speakers. To confirm that the AEC is properly routed, navigate back to the Intellimix section of the MXA910, select AEC, and confirm that the far end audio is reflected on the reference meter.